Thank you, Kevin. Well, it's been voted the best French cuisine in Detroit by Our Magazine. What Crepe is a cozy French-inspired restaurant located in the heart of Royal Oak. Nick Rockwell and Cheryl Campbell from What Crepe are here to show us how to create the perfect Valentine's Day experience. So thank you both for joining us this morning. Thank, thank you. you. First of all, congrats on being voted best of Detroit um, in Our Magazine. Thank you. So give me a feel of the restaurant. It's such a, a great place. I mean, we're really unique. Uh, it's a great place to bring a date. We now have our bistro license, so we're able to serve um, a great variety of beers, mm -hmm. wines. Um, Thursdays is our martini night. All right. We do a French kiss martini. It's mm -hmm. absolutely delicious. Um, it's just a great place to share a bottle of wine and, you know, have a nice date night. For those who tend to be a little intimidated by French cuisine, what would you say to them? Actually, we have such a variety. We have over 50 types of crepes, from sweet to savory. Um, it is just, you can get anything you want, pretty much. Okay. And the portion sizes are fantastic. I absolutely love it there. All right, big day for you guys, Valentine's Day? You know, actually, Mondays were closed for private events. Mm -hmm. um, and I know a lot of people that are going to be celebrating this weekend. Okay. You know? uh, Thursday nights, Friday nights, and Saturday nights were open till midnight. All right, perfect. Well, thank you. And so, Nate, you are the crepe master, I take it? I am, it? I am. <laughs> All right, right. Today I'm going to make a, a new uh, menu item. It's, a, it's called spicy crab hash with a uh, red pepper and pineapple relish. So I'm just, it's a real easy a dish you can make at home. So uh, we'll just start that off. Um, I'm going to start off with the relish. Take some onions, sweat the onions out, a little garlic, some red peppers, some pineapples. I could pass you some things if you like. Oh. <laughs> you can put me to work, Nate. That's good. That's good. Okay. Uh, let's see. We're going to take uh, these potatoes right here. Oh, I thought that was cheese. How do I know? Now, all of this is done in olive oil? This is butter. Butter. Yeah. Okay. Even better. Even better. Right. Butter makes everything better. <laughs> Kick up my heat. Now, what is this? This is my called. crepe, my crepe griddle. All right. Where all the magic's done. For people who don't have a crepe griddle, a skill it'll do. This is a uh, skill will do. Yes. This is about 600 degrees, though. Now, what's Very in your hot. crepe batter? Is it like pancake batter? It is, it is like pancake batter, only there's no baking soda in it. Oh. Well, that is quite cool. All right. So, now, what's the hardest thing about making crepes? Do they burn easily? They, they do burn easy. Uh, you have to be very careful with, with uh, the amount of time that you are. I'm going to put some brown sugar here in my salsa. A couple cinnamon sticks. So this is uh, my spicy crab hash. We're going to do uh, hash browns, some jumbo lump crab, uh, some scallions. Let that heat up real good. Love the flip. <laughs> I end up with things all over my kitchen floor when I try that, but you make it look easy. Oh, thank you. And then I'm going to finish this off with some eggs. Everything right in together. This is the important part. Oh, beautiful brown. Okay, and of course we have this this recipe on our website at myfoxdetroit.com as he finishes that up. This is the finished product, so this is what it looks like when it's all done and beautiful. <laughs> of course, so if you don't want to do all this, you can just check out the restaurant.